Judge, we'll see who rules the galaxy when this is over. Do not fail the Daleks indeed. <laughs> Tin boxes. <laughs> Yeah, it's a different morality. Get used to it or What do you think of that now, eh? A Viking helmet. Oh, uh, maybe. What do you mean, maybe? What do you think it is? Helmet for a cow? I have nothing but these clothes that I will. What is it, Doctor? Well, I've just realised I don't even own these. I borrowed them from the hospital. There's just going to be a localised volcanic eruption. It'll only affect the island. Maybe so, but we happen to be on the island. Oh, you are informed that the occupant is a known criminal, whereupon you allow him to escape and conceal himself in a building a mere 53 stories by A clever stratagem, Hello Red. You're trying to confuse him, I take it. I flutter my fingers, gaze deep into the ball, and then... Then? Then I make up whatever comes into my head. Well, when will you be ready, for heaven's sake? That next Christmas, I shouldn't wonder. I'm going to die. Well, so am I, one day. Don't you dare. All right, I'll try not to. Oh, this is getting monotonous. There is no plot! I am being completely honest with you. No. It's all right, I've dealt with it. Dealt with it? You've ruined it. But your match was on fire. Three months of delicate work, and now look at it, you Cabinet room. If the cabinet's in session and in danger, these are about the four most safest walls in the whole of Great Britain. End of lesson. <laughs> Installed in 1991. Three inches of steel lining every single wall. They'll never get in. And how do we get out? Well, he has arrived. Involving this does not please me. Now then, what can I do for you? You are one of the most <laughs> beings this Time Lord race has ever produced. Your crimes are without number and your villainy without end. What's happened to the little The little is perfectly all right, thank you very much. <coughs> I know this is going to be hard to believe, Doctor, but for once I mean you no harm. Like Alice, I tried to believe three things before breakfast. They, uh, they're, not, they're not me one, they, they're asking questions one. Names, not my area. Clara! Well, it might be Clara, it might not be. It's a lottery. It is Clara! Well, I'm not ruling it. I won't Shut it! Oh! You're gonna die this all too! No, oh, shut up. We don't have the brains. Look at you. I can't be a decent species. Planet of the brains. It's the neck. That's what's wrong with it. It just don't look realistic. You have good eyes. I do, it happens. Very good eyes. They're my greatest gift. I accept. What's that for? Your gift. I have 
eyes. I'm receiving a communication from the Earthbound ships. They have a message for the human race. Put it through. Let's hear it. You have more letters after your name than anyone I know. Enough for two alphabets. How is it you can be such a... <laughs> what are you smarting at, you, you hairy Highlander? I'm just admiring your diplomatic skills. I can do kidneys. I don't like the colour. Off your kidneys. Yes, well, I'll tell you something that should be of vital interest to you, Professor. But what? That you, sir, are an... Real time. What is it? Frax Owen. Traces of it in his pocket. So? The criminals must be caught, eh, Doctor? Oh, for sake. You're under arrest.